The Vice President has asked that uh, we bless this occasion with prayer. And so let us pray. The prophet Micah proclaims, You have been told, O mortal, what is good, and what the Lord requires of you, only to do justice and to love goodness, and to walk humbly with your God. Gracious God, at this moment in our history, we ask your blessing on your servant Joseph as he renews his sacred pledge to his country. Amid all the complexities of our world, a world so beautiful but also broken, give him a share of your wisdom so that he can know what is good and give him the courage to always do what is right. Walk close by him so that he can do justice and to labor tirelessly for a more just and gentle world. Empower him to be a voice for those without a voice, for those on the margins, those so easily overlooked, for you will judge us all by how we care for the least among us. Continue to give him the humility to always call upon you in times of need and with the gift of faith given to him by his church and his family, help him to always know of your presence. Lord, protect our president and our vice president and their families in their service to us all. Finally, we thank you for the blessings of peace and of liberty. We honor the sacrifices of so many in our military, in our foreign service, and civil service who safeguard these blessings daily. And we renew our pledge as citizens to join them in that noble labor to always work for the common good. And so help us to set aside self-interest and to meet one another on the common ground to which you call us. You, generous God, have given us so much. And we humbly offer these gifts for the good of others and for your greater glory. Amen. Mr. Rice, President, are you ready, sir? I am here. Please place your hand on the Bible and raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, Joseph R. Biden, Jr., do solemnly swear. I, Joseph R. Biden, Jr., do solemnly swear. That I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States. That I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States. Against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Against all enemies, foreign and domestic. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. That I take this obligation freely. That I take this obligation freely. Without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion. Without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion. And that I will well and faithfully discharge. And that I will well and faithfully discharge. The duties of the office on which I am about to enter. The duties of the office on which I am about to enter. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.